of them going for touchdowns. He made his mark on special teams as he gets started for the club. But in this week's Epic Western Genuine Titans segment, Amy Wells takes us through the story of NWI on the field and the special guy that he's always been off the field. You see the plays on Sundays. Receivers to the right. Going to give Henry a turn. He pitches it back to Tannehill. He throws deep right side. There's Westbrook. Akita, 35, 30, 25, 20, 15, 10, 5, yeah! end zone. Yeah! Touchdown! Tight! And sometimes it's easy to forget that before the bright lights in the packed stadiums of the National Football League, before the roaring fans and tradition of the Indiana Hoosiers, Nick Westbrook Akine was just Nick, a wide receiver for the Lake Mary Rams. The tall kid from Central Florida made an impression early in his career, really early. Well, it's funny because Nick came to one of our youth camps as a little kid. So we saw him like in third grade and he stood out then even. It, it's, you know, he's a tall kid, had good hands and we're like, okay, we can't wait for this guy to get here. So he got as a freshman, he came out and uh, just was a great receiver for the freshman team. And then at the end of the freshman season, he's one of the kids that we brought up to the varsity level. Um, and, you know, the, the rest is history. Probably his sophomore year, you know, he started to stand out. He started for us as a sophomore. And uh, there were times it was just, you know, whenever we needed a first down, it's throw it to Nick. Throw it to Nick. It's third and long, throw it up to Nick, and he'll, he'll make it happen. And uh, we had a quarterback. Uh, who was pretty good at the time, who, who could buy him some time and run around with his feet a little bit and, and, and get on the edge and uh, allow Nick to go deep and just loft it up there to him. There's some times, one play in particular stands out. Uh, we are in a, a game against uh, Oviedo and Nick Westbrook was, was right down there in the middle of the end zone. And we Oviedo had a guy on each side and a guy in front. And Nick just goes up between all three of them and grabs the ball. I mean, it's just, you're like that, that doesn't happen every day. So but I'd say that point <laughs> as a 10th grader, we knew. It wasn't just his athleticism that stood out. Nick Westbrook Akine was as good a person as he was an athlete. And that's saying something because NWI was a great athlete. In his time at Lake Mary High School, he set school records for career, single season, and single game receiving yards. He also holds the school's touchdown record. As a senior, he caught 84 passes for 1,853 yards and 21 touchdowns. It always feels good to win. Always feels good to win. Records are broken and stats come and go. He, he's just such a good kid. He was just so nice to everybody. He was in the, the Best Buddy program that helped kids that were special needs kids. And he, uh, AP classes, smart, a yes sir kid. All his teachers loved him. I mean, he was a leader in the weight room. He had tremendous work ethic. Uh, the stats will be broken. You know, eventually someone's gonna come along and break some of those records. But uh, what stands out is just the quality of person that he is. He was such a high quality person that he was recently inducted into the Lake Mary Hall of Fame. The honor recognizes alumni who have achieved greatness and who represent the values of a Lake Mary student. That is Nick Westbrook Akine. Now as a Titan, he has continued down the same path. After being brought in as a rookie free agent, he earned a starting role in just two years. He has become a leader within the receiver's room. Yeah, Nick is every year he's consistently grown in one area or another. Uh, smart football player, uh, really disciplined, uh, fundamentals. Um, you know, when you, when you if you can have a poster child of someone who does everything right, that, that's that's who it be. And he has still found time to invest in the Nashville community, continuing the tradition that he started as a kid at Lake Mary High School. We, of course, we, we always, you know, with social media now, we can always find a highlight of him doing something, and especially when he was in Indiana, we we always found highlights and linked them to him and and uh, said, hey, watch this. And, that's the type of kid, type of play we want you to make, and that's the type of person we want you to be. We, we always talk about it. He is a favorite around Ascension St. Thomas Sports Park, and you see that in his high school Hall of Fame already in Lake Mary, Florida, a graduate of the Kellogg School of Business at Indiana University, um, a guy that sort of fits the bill of what we call a genuine Titan. Yeah, I mean, I think I'd be echoing a lot of things that was said there about him. I mean, he's He's, he's been consistent ever since he came here as a rookie free agent. 
Uh, there's been no job that's too big for Nick to take on. There's been no task that's asked of him that's too small uh, for him to say, let me do that, whether it's be a gunner on the punt team, whether it's run down on kickoff, uh, line up in the slot, line up at outside, block, um, catch, run. You know, he's just been a, he's a great teammate, and uh, I know the guys really look up to him and the way that he approaches his job on a day-in and day-out basis.